one of the Philippine Navy's most capable surface combatants, fast attack interdiction craft BRP Nestor Acero, PG-901, got more potent as its battle net, BNET, system got a significant upgrade from Israeli defense manufacturer Rafael Advanced Defense Systems. This upgrade was validated through a comprehensive sea trial near Manila Bay and Cavite City, involving PG-901 and five other ACPGs, Acero-class patrol gunboats, the BRP Nestor Acero said in a Facebook post Monday night. It added that the sea trial was held on July 4, which tested the connectivity and communication range of the upgraded BNET system, focusing on voice, chat, and video feed relay. No other details on the system's upgrade were provided for security reasons. The results exceeded baseline specifications, confirming the upgrade's success. This enhancement significantly boosts the ACPG fleet's operational capabilities, ensuring improved connectivity and real-time communication for modern naval operations, the post read. BRP Nestor Acero. PG-901. Test the vessel's upgraded, battle net, BNET system during a sea trial in this July 4, 2024 the PN now has six Acero-class gunboats in service, with the BRP Nestor Acero as the lead ship. The first two Acero-class gunboats, the BRP Nestor Acero, PG-901, and BRP Lalanado Taong, PG-902, were delivered in September 2022 and commissioned two months later. The third and fourth FAICs, the BRP Jenner Tinamog, PG-903, and BRP Domingo de Luana, PG-905, were delivered in April 2023 and commissioned the following month. The fifth and sixth were named the BRP Ermenegildo Urong, PG-906, and BRP Lawrence Nari, PG-907, respectively, and were commissioned on May 21 this year. All six Acero-class gunboats were named after Medal of Valor awardees. The remaining three Acero-class gunboats are expected to be constructed and delivered within the next two years. The Philippine Navy commissioned its fifth and sixth Acero-class fast interdiction attack aircraft with the Littoral Combat Force May 21 last year at PN headquarters in Manila. The FAICs, BRP Ermenegildo Urong, PG-906, and BRP Lawrence Nari, PG-907, were the first of their class to be armed with the Spike NLOS surface-to-surface -surface missile. The other four ships of the previously commissioned class do not have missile systems but have deployment for MLS NLOS Typhoon missile launcher installations if the Philippine Navy decides to equip them with them. The ships were acquired as part of the Philippine Navy's fast attack interdiction craft with missiles, FAICM, acquisition project under the second list of Horizon 2 phase of the RAFPMP. To replace aging assets of the Littoral Combat Force, LCF, with assets that can protect restricted sea lanes of communications. SLOC. Within the Philippine archipelago, the Philippine Navy has embarked on the acquisition of Fast Attack Interdiction Crafts, FAIC, which are fast-moving, light and small and are armed with surface-to-surface -surface missiles with up to 25-kilometer range. The project, now known as the Fast Attack Interdiction Craft, Missile Capable, FAICM, Acquisition Project, is a special project that was not included in the Horizon 2 Phase Priority Projects, but was approved for implementation after an urgent requirement. They are said to be replaced the Tomas Badillo Class PKM Fast Attack Crafts, some of which were already retired and the rest on track for retirement in a couple of years. Based on the approved plan, the Philippine Navy will procure eight, eight, fast attack interdiction craft, FAIC, based on the technical requirements they submitted to the President. The budget will be PHP 10 billion, around 193 million United States dollars. This was changed in late 2020 to 9. 9 units after negotiations between the DND, Philippine Navy and Israel shipyards.